Hey, good morning, guys. Um, here I wanted to show you this eucalyptus lococcylon. I think luco means white, and um, I forgot what xylon means. Um, but here it is. Um, it's also one of the most widely used species around California. It's really nice. Has this. Um, mo it's a very variable species, but most of them has this nice white trunk. Uh, it's a much smaller tree compared to the globulus and some of the other commonly used ones um, and it has green greenish leaves compared to some of the other species um, and some of them for example this one um, I want to show you this phenomena um, that you see those longitudinal splits sometimes along the trunk and Usually that's not a huge concern because this is actually caused by too rapid growth um, Too much, you know, girth growth. So essentially the trunk just split <laughs> And uh, the leaves are nice um, I don't think they're too special in any sense, but they're nice This one is not in flower, but you can see the fruits up there um, There is more um, the one over there with this shiny white trunk is also Eucalyptus lococcylon. Um, the one there and back behind those um, dumpster looking things. And there are globulus, of course. There's lots of them on Stanford campus. Um, and the juvenile leaf on this lococcylon is also... I'm sorry about the lighting. Um, is also opposite to each other. Um, I'm trying to find a flower, but I couldn't see any right now. Um, there, there were a lot of them in, in bloom a few months ago. Um, but this species is very, very, very var variable. And the flowers are also, some of them are quite large, some of them are smaller, they have different colors. Um, it's a really useful species. Um, for you know an ornamental purpose um, yeah and again this is eucalyptus lococcylon um, hope you enjoy the video see you next time